Cause I know, long time no talk. Um, let me see if I can kind of prop you guys up. Ooh. Okay. So long time no talk. Um, last time I talked to you guys, I was doing a um, video on um, the gender reveal I did through blood tests, through like mailing it out or whatever. That was the last time I talked to you guys. A lot has happened since then. Um, of course, I've had baby Jace, um, and he is a healthy, beautiful baby boy. Um, and right now, we are in the process of moving. So, when I did that video, we were or currently in an apartment. Um, I can't do this apartment no more. All right, because these neighbors, my upstairs neighbors, they try me. They just moved there, maybe about a month, like maybe two, three months ago and it's just they're just they're just nasty neighbors they make all this noise they let their kids run back and forth they wake me up at six o'clock in the morning it's just i don't want to live there you know what i'm saying and then realizing that we yeah we are an apartment but jace is gonna start you know crawling and walking before we know it and um even though we do have a couple months but it's gonna come around fast and he needs space to roam and janae needs space too um um and you know speaking of janae we have decided to homeschool with all the covid stuff going on and with us having a newborn in the house so we have decided to homeschool so she needs her own little space too and we just all need space we're a growing family we need some space to roam and you know do what we want to do and also we want to be on post because with us living all the way out here in watertown it is kind of difficult for my husband well it's not difficult but it's a while for my husband to get to and from um work and it's just easier if we lived on post and especially with the weather being how we heard it's going to be we hear that the winters are pretty brutal here and we just want to make sure that he is you know can get to and from work safely so we just made the decision of living on post um, so we got the keys yesterday um, We're in on post so I'm gonna show you guys the house because I'm actually on my way to the house But I stopped at Target because I need to get a mop We've been using like a Swiffer because the apartment doesn't really have any like actual floors So we have the Swiffer for the apartment, but we're, I need an actual mop and um, um, And I'm gonna get um, a freaking chai tea from Starbucks while I'm in here But I need a mop and then I'm gonna go in to the new house show you guys give you our tour of the house and then i'm gonna do a clean before we actually move our stuff in here we move our stuff tomorrow we got the u-haul of course we have to move ourselves the military only moves you that one time and if you want to move any other time besides the pcs season you have to move yourself so we pay for all that and we just have a quite a lot to do i'm going to try to I, I i say this all the time i'm gonna try to get the vlogs back popping i'm not working right now right now i'm just at home with the babies and with the kids so you know i got nothing but time on my hands and you know now that we on post and now like things with covid is starting to lift up a little bit you know maybe i can start exploring um you know for a drum in the new york uh upstate new york area and you know take you guys along with me so yep so we finna go in here and uh, get this mop and then we're gonna see what's up and I definitely gotta just clean the house I don't know about you guys I don't know how y'all was raised but you know when you move into a house a new house new apartment new cottage whatever you're moving to always clean your house you know what I'm saying we don't know how these people was living before us so I do have all my cleaning supplies in the back I don't know if y'all see it I have all my clean surprise in my back as well as some insect repellent um um they get like spiders and stuff here so i want to clean and then spray like all the counters i mean on the counters i want to spray like the back door um where the garage is and all that extra stuff just to make sure there's no spiders and everything like that but all right i'll see you guys later all right so this is the front of the house Um, so, okay. nice little deck. I'm going to enter through the front door. All right. 
So that was the front door. Um, so when you come in, there is a coat closet. Very spacious. All right, and then there's also our living room. And it has a um, fan, which I love. But this is the living room. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then we have a spacious kitchen. As soon as I get the light. Okay, I love this kitchen. I love the island because, okay, like I like to serve, I like to entertain when I do have people, and I do love the island. I think it's great. Um, we have a nice refrigerator, we have all the appliances, dishwasher, a gas stove, microwave comes with the house, which is great. And we also have mad storage space, mad cabinet. So I do like that. I do like that. So, yep, cabinet space, pantry. Definitely need a step stool in here. That's pretty high. But yeah, a lot of space. Okay, this area right here is going to be the dining room area. Um, I'm not sure how I'm going to put my dining room table, but this is the dining room area so yeah I love the dark floors um, my friend up the street she has light floors um, but I, I do like the, the dark floors and to the right um, is going to be our homeschool slash play area for Jace and Janae um, there's like a little nook over here cabinets a little um, a little table here so I'm gonna set up her laptop and her school supplies and my laptop and stuff like that so when I go back to school I can do my work here too and then I'm thinking about maybe having a little mini like TV and putting a mat here so whenever Jay starts crawling and stuff he has something for him to do um, I mean somewhere for him to play so yeah so there's a lot of ideas I have on um, this house is a lot more spacious than our Kansas house um, so, but I have plenty of ideas of how to decorate this space and decorate um, the whole house. So I plan on doing a lot more videos um, on decor and basically just trying to make my military house a home. It's not really too much we can do because we are renting this space, but I'm gonna do the best I can to make it homey. But yeah, so that's that space. And then take you over here. This is the um, backyard or side yard. Um, because we do have a corner house, we have a side yard, but this is great. I'm gonna open the door. It's raining, so but yeah, it's a side side yard. Nice little area to put our grill. And you know, a nice place to people watch. I have a 360 view. I can see what's going on. Yeah, so how you doing? 360 view. Yep. So neighbors are friendly, which is always nice. Um, right here is the laundry room. Wait, there you go. Okay, light takes a second. All right, but it's a laundry room. Very spacious. I do have ideas on how to um, make this prettier because it's it's a bit bland, and uh, I spend a lot of my time in the laundry room doing laundry. So definitely gonna try to revamp that. And then before I take you guys to the garage, I'm gonna go upstairs. Let's go upstairs and see what's going on. Over here is the um, storage closet. Um, I'm gonna be putting my cleaning supplies and um, mops, brooms, vacuum cleaners, all that good stuff up there. Um, they, this is the, where the router goes. They have like, it's, the lady said it was like designed to like, basically go throughout the whole house. So put the, the router up there and it, it, it should work throughout the whole house, but yeah. This is the half bath. Yeah. This toilet is kind of low. I don't know if it's I don't know if it's me or whatever, but it kind of looks kind of low, but it's decent. Then the mirror. I like these um, lights up there. It's really bright. But yeah, so that's that storage, which we love. We love storage. Alright, so we're gonna go upstairs now. There's definitely need a baby gate <laughs> when Jay starts moving. Okay, so to the left, it is a room. Let me kind of back it up here. It's 
the room. This would be Janae's room. Nice closet. Yeah. Nice closet. And then here is the, I guess it's called a Jack, Jack and Jill bathroom. They share, share bathrooms, but this is the bathroom. Nice size bathroom for them to share. Yep, so storage down there for them. And this is Mr. Jace's room. There's closets right there. And then here is our room. Oh, hallway closet, I didn't notice that before. Hallway closet, which is a must for linens and towels and things. And here is our room. Ceiling fan, thank God, so I get hot. I don't know about anybody else, but I, I have to sleep with the fan on. It doesn't matter if it's summer or winter, I have to have the fan. But yeah, so that's our room. Here is the master closet. It's a decent size. A lot smaller than Kansas was, but you know, we make it work. Make it work. And here is the master bathroom. This and her sinks. Big old mirror, which I love. Another closet for our goodies. And then the toilet and the, you know, the tub and all that. Yep, so I'm gonna go ahead and take you guys down to the garage. Um, I got Edgar's car today because I have um, the cleaning supplies in there, but this is the garage. It's a decent size. I do like this garage. I love that this garage door is automatic. We did not have that in Kansas. If we wanted to open our garage, we had to get out of our car and open our garage. So that is nice to have. And then two, we have a utility closet here. Um, this closet is um, to store Edgar's army stuff. Um, now his uniforms will go in the house, but like um, they have helmets and tough boxes and uh, weighted vests and all that, all the crap that they kind of issue them in the military that you really don't want in your house. So that's here and have hooks and shelves, which I really think is really cool. So somebody has, <laughs> somebody has definitely listened to a military wife, okay? Because don't nobody want that stuff in the house. So yeah, and like I was saying, um, we pull in through here and we just go in through the back of our house, which is great because we really don't want people knowing when we're home or not, you know? So I like that. Um, but yeah, that's it. So um, right now I'm about to come on light. Okay, so right now I'm about to get the stuff out the car and we're gonna get cleaning. All right.